not that deep. No, it's like three feet. Uh, <laughs> I don't think I'm getting up. Oh, Lordy. What's going on, everyone? My name is JP. This is my wife, Jordana, and our kids, Aurelia and Odin. Back on our sixth wedding anniversary, we decided we wanted to buy an RV and see the country. Fast forward to March of 2021, we sold our house, ditched all our stuff, and hit the road for what we hope will be a journey filled with a lifetime of memories. We hope you will join us on this journey as we wander to get lost. It is May 28th, Friday. Our stay at Bahia Honda is coming to an end. Uh, we're just out for a bike ride. We wanted to see the other side of the park over here. This is the open, I guess, tent camping and cabin rental section on this lagoon, which is absolutely gorgeous. And we're just gonna ride over to the beach, take a quick dip, and we have to be out of here by one o'clock, and then we're off to Fiesta Key, um, RV park and marina. On the way to Fiesta Key, I know we're probably gonna stop in Marathon. We gotta get some dog food for Odie, and maybe, uh, I know we need some propane for our grill, and we're probably gonna hit a seafood market, get some fish for tonight. It's high tide. Oh, found it. There it is. All right, so yesterday at the sunset, they dropped one of their, their toy tires into the water. Ah, uh, I see it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go get it. We don't wanna leave it there. How? I don't know, I'm gonna hop in. No. Yeah. The tides, the water's up a lot more, so I should be able to climb out. If not, I got about probably 100 yards to swim. Careful, Daddy. There he goes. It's not that deep. No, it's like three feet. Uh. I don't think I'm getting up. Oh, Lordy. See, I told you. Go as hard as you can. Alright. Here, I'll, help, I'll, I'll get on my tummy. Alright. And I can pull you up. But you, that means you guys need to, to move back. You guys need to move back here. Really, you're in charge of this. Come here. You hold this and you, you take a, like a, alright. No, you'll scrape your whole tummy. Watch out, stay, nope, stay right there. What? It is. I want my leg to face. Watch. They're nice and hairy, so you can grip. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Ready? Come on, I can pull you with my leg. You didn't let me check. You didn't let me try. All right, no. stay right there. Don't move. You folks camping with us? Yes. Just so you know, all the And I got my real, real tire. Thank tiger. you very much. What you got there? My real tire in the ocean. Yeah, we dropped it, and our daddy saved it. Look at that. 
Save the wheel. All right, Daddy, save the wheel. All right. And then, and then Daddy might rescue himself. Yep. <laughs> Daddy, I need, I need my wheel and my tire. Okay. You're right. I thought. Because I can, I can. No, the water, I the water wasn't that deep, but it was still. Uh, it was probably three and a half feet below. The, uh, the walk or the cement top and unfortunately I'm not in the best shape to do a muscle up right now and I couldn't get out so yeah I can do muscle but we got some help so yep all right now we're going to the beach to go for a dip because yeah it's 11 30 we gotta go Hey, what's going on everybody? It is moving day. So our one stay at, one night stay at uh, Bahia is over. Uh, we're all packed up, same as we always do. It went really quick. You can see we just didn't really pack everything away. We just put it because we basically just have a 40 minute drive to Fiesta Key RV Park. So there goes Jordana and the kids. They're gonna just turn around. We're gonna pull out and then uh, we're out of here. Test, test, Shmoopy, can you hear me? Uh, well, we're actually going to stop first at um, the Publix in Marathon. I think that's what we're doing right now. Uh, sorry. And then... Um, get a few things we need dog food for Odie and um, wanna, I think we, we wanna, wanna get some fish for dinner tonight and then um, yeah so and then we also need propane for our grill so yeah we gotta get that as well all right so it says 14 miles to the Publix and Marathon so that's our first stop for today 
know where they went. I think they went and did a loop around that way. I'm going to drive this way. This is all the way down. Babe, I was like, something is not okay with those stinking bites. I kept saying it to myself. I'm like, all right, he said it's okay. I had him cinched I know you did. I don't know what happened. I could not tell you what happened, but I am going to tell you that I knew something was not right. All right, I'll take care of I know you did, but I, I don't trust this thing. Hopefully that works better. What? I said hopefully that works better. Um, I don't know. Did you turn it off? The generator is running so Odie doesn't die. Oh my god, right. Okay. <laughs> Do you have your wallet? Oh shoot. have them at Fiesta Key and if they have like a, a store but I don't okay. know yeah because they had them at Sunshine Key in like in that little store yeah we're just gonna come to the RV right the yeah Yeah, we got we got our groceries, so now we gotta pack it away, and then we gotta go to the RV park. Bless you. Bless you.
what's going on everybody we are at sun uh sorry <laughs> forza habit we were at fiesta key rv marina and park uh on the fiesta key uh so we got checked in a few hours ago we got all set up and we actually have our friends who we were at sunshine key with and who live in key west they're visiting us for tonight so they're staying with us till tomorrow and tomorrow we're actually going to go check out curry hammock state park and go explore that place tomorrow so uh, it was an easy travel day we just went food shopping came here i gotta say the check-in process for fiesta key not very well done um their office i don't know for whatever reason is still closed down probably because of the construction that's going on they have the security guard um with all the paperwork in the booth and he's going back and forth to the rvs gets the information goes in the booth comes back with the paperwork then the encore staff uh, person escorts you to your site the other issue is that if you ask the security guard a question you get a different answer than you if you ask the encore person a question so there's a couple that's a couple of things that we noticed just on this check-in process sunshine key was a better much better check-in process they also have a, a bigger area to pull your RV in uh, to facilitate that so um yeah but otherwise this park is gorgeous we're about to head over to the pool and right next to the pool is the beach so we're probably just going to spend the rest of the evening there and then have some dinner and then tomorrow is a nice fun exploration day at curry hammock state park so uh other than that we're going to be here till june 1st we're staying through memorial day weekend we didn't want to travel on the weekend just uh avoid the roads with everybody being out there and then june 1st we're off to miami and from there we'll be there for a little bit to explore Everglades and Biscayne National Park and then we'll be traveling further north to go to Legoland for Odin's birthday so that's just a little what's coming up all right so we're just wrangling all the kids because now um, with them spending the night we have four adults four kids staying in the RV and yeah it's gonna be a little crowded but just for one night we can make the most out of it have a blast um, and then we're going to all go to Curry Hammock and explore together tomorrow. So, looking forward to that. Uh, other than that, my, it's time to go swim, like we always do. We always go to the pool first thing we get to the RV park. All right, I'll see you soon. Yeah. 